Well, hello, ladies and gentlemen. You are welcome to another episode of Reverb News. I am Asari Duke, your host, and it is a pleasure to be hosting today's episode. Well, let's head on to today's headlines. Don't move a muscle. And on today's headlines, we're talking about Nollywood mourns the death of a celebrity baby. Caroline Danjuma gets an addition to her family. And also, let's talk about the actress and OAP who comes under fire for this outfit. All of this is on Reverb News. Okay, everybody, welcome back to Reverb News. We're talking about actress Caroline Danjuma, now known as Caroline Hutchings, after her very infamous divorce from her husband. Well, we're not here to talk about divorce and sad stories. Let's talk about good things. Now, Caroline has been termed as a hero after she announced on her Instagram page the newest addition to her family. The beautiful actress has disclosed she has adopted a beautiful baby girl which she plans to love and take care of like her biological child. Many seem to appreciate this kind gesture and of course have been heaping praises on the beautiful actress's name. Now good luck and good job Caroline Danjima. Way to go. Over the weekend, Nollywood and the entire world were deeply saddened over the sudden death of pop star Dibanja's son. It is gathered that the one-year-old drowned in their indoor pool in Ikoi, Lagos State. Details are still very sketchy about the unfortunate events. However, Nollywood stars like Tonto DK, who was formerly signed on the Music Stars label, has come forth to pay her condolences. Other stars like Omotala Ikeinde, Kate Henshaw, RMD, Ireti Doyle, have all shown their sincere apologies for his unfortunate loss. A big brother and a mentor lost someone very right dear. I'm sure we all heard the news, so I think it's only right that we have a minute of silence for Daniel the Third. Please. So can we all stand for just one minute? May the soul of Daniel the Third, uh, all those that lost their lives in Benue as well, rest in perfect peace. Tribe TV also sends our condolences to the pop star and his family. Okay, lastly on today's news, this one definitely involves you. What do you think of this outfit of actress Lolo, also known as Adaku? A lot of her fans seem to not be pleased by her dress sense or her choice of wardrobe, leaving remarks like, Lolo, you are too old for this, and another one suggesting that the actress needs to learn how to flatter her body with her clothes. Well, in all fairness, Lolo has come a very long way with her weight loss journey, and I'm sure she's glad she can finally rock outfits like these. Well, let's just cut her some slack. But what do you guys think? Is this outfit trashy or classy? You can let us know on our Twitter page, which is at Tribes TV. So that's it on today's episode. Stick around for the news recap. You are still tuned on to Reverb News, but not for long. We're just about to give you the news recap before we sign out on today's episode. Well, if you're just tuning in, this is what we talked about on today's show. On today's news, we talked about Nollywood, who mourns the death of Dibanja's son, Daniel. Caroline Danjuma gets a new addition to her family as she has just adopted a beautiful baby girl. And lastly, 
actress and OAP Lolo comes under heated fire for her choice of wardrobe. So guys, I feel like I don't have to keep on giving you our social media handles all the time because it should have stuck by now. I keep on saying it at the end of every episode. Well, here they go as well. Also, you can catch us on our website, which is www.tribe.tv. You can check me out on Instagram, which is Asari Duke underscore, where you can find the link to the Tribe TV's Instagram handle. I'll catch you guys next time, and I hope you had a fun time. And um, enjoy Tribe TV movies. <laughs>